In this tutorial, I'm going to show you a very minimal design uh, slide in PowerPoint. As you can see here, I've just added some align kind of uh, arrow where I've just put uh, option one uh, and I've given the shadow effect. And then you can add some the titles here. Then the, this is for the option two with the icon, option three and option four. This is very simple plain slide. So this is very helpful for the people who don't like much colors and wants the slide to be very simple enough. So uh, let's see how to do this in PowerPoint. Add a new slide, then go to insert shapes and from a block arrows, I'm just going to select which is arrow pentagon. Just draw one arrow like this and then go to rotate and just say flip horizontal press ctrl d to duplicate it and go to rotate and then say again flip horizontal so it comes this side so exactly on top of this i'm just going to add then i'm going to set both of these arrows uh, holding the shift key ctrl d to duplicate it and put it here so you can see here i have added a four arrows to this so I'm going to select this all four arrows while holding the shift key, right mouse click, go to a format object and go to fill, say a no fill. So you got only this, uh, the outlines only. So even the outlines also, you can just reduce the point, the width, maybe 0.5. So you can see here, uh, just the arrow outline is there now you must have uh, done the tracing when we are kids generally we do the tracing you know just putting some image in the bottom uh, at the back side of the paper and then we start the tracing the similar thing i'm just going to do it now to do the tracing you have to go to insert shapes and select this one which is a free form shape so let me just start from here and just click on this end then here it doesn't matter if something goes wrong also we can just adjust it later again here so i'm just doing exactly on top of that just click one only one time only otherwise if you click two times it will come out So just do the tracing as the kids do. So here till here only I'm doing double click. That's it. So I'm just going to change the color of this to something this color and I'm going to increase the width. You can see here then just delete this one i don't need this anymore now the one which i have created before so you can see here we have uh, made this design i'm just going to select this design go to shape fill and say white color so it's filled with white color now can you see here it is white color now now this looks very plain and then let me just add some shadow effect for that go to insert shapes uh, select a, a oval shape draw the oval shape maybe this much size shape outline make it no outline and shape fill select a black color and you can increase some of the transparency level then go to effects soft adjust increase the size can you see here something like this you got this one maybe you can go and increase the transparency level further and put it here if you want you can just increase the size also and just send this to back so you can see here it looks the arrow it's now let me just bring it more down here yeah Control D, put it here, send this to back, Control D, 
put one here send to back and control d select this and send to back so you can see here as if the arrows are right it has come from the shadows the last step is to add the text and if required you can add some icons to add the text i'm just going to type 01 center align increase the size change the font to any of your favorite font and give a gray color put it here this is 01 control d align it in the center again control d this is for the third and this is for fourth So let me just change this now to three and four. All right, now it's time to add some detailed text. First start with your title. Again, I'm going to give the gray color, center align, same font I'm going to use make it bold and then you can add some detailed text again reduce the size the same color i'm going to give and that's it I'm just going to select this control G to group it control D to duplicate put it this side here control D one will go here control D another will go here so that's it if you want you can just go to insert you can select some icons for this you need to have an internet uh, active internet connection so I'm just going to select any four uh, icons and I'm going to give the same uh, uh, gray color and I'm going to make it 0.4 only and then start putting one by one here. So you can see here our design is ready. It's a very minimal design and this looks very good in any of your presentations. That's it from me friends. Thank you for watching my YouTube channel and don't forget to subscribe PowerPoint University. See you soon with more interesting stuff. Till then, goodbye.